I bought two of these grams of gold. It's very small, but they're like actually over $50 each. It shows how much gold is. If silver goes up to that price, uh, at the price of gold, which they, I mean it should really, because it, there's actually a lot more gold in the world than silver now. But um, it just shows, this is $50. Imagine if this was silver and it was $50. I mean, uh, that's where it's going. That's where silver is going. Anyways, uh, I'm showing this because um, I tried to make colloidal gold. Colloidal gold is for health. Like you just put, pass electricity through the gold into a water and then it makes bubbles and adds gold into the water. And I made something out of it. I drank the, I tried drinking the water that ma was created out of it and I got seriously sick, like I had been poisoned. Uh, so I don't know what I made, but it was with this gold. But I tarnished it. I'm gonna see if I can fix it. Um, there's different people, they say, oh, you should soak it in shampoo. I don't know what's up with that. Or, but I think that's for getting oils out from, from like, that are from the skin. Uh, this isn't, this isn't from that. This is from <laughs> electricity passing through it. So I don't, I don't know what's going to happen there. But I don't, anyways, um, the other way they have is with, oh, they do, no, so I think one person used lemon, uh, lemon juice, but I'm going to use vinegar, uh, because vinegar seems to be a fairly popular one with gold and vinegar and baking soda with silver I'm gonna try that later just straight uh, baking soda and vinegar um, so yeah I, I got two of these you can see and this one is really bad because it, it, when you're passing electricity through you um, the one end, I don't forget if it's negative or positive, gets a lot dirtier. Um, very tarnished. I mean, this should be shiny gold, right? So I'm going to try cleaning them because right now they're probably not worth $50. And if I, they're all shiny, they're probably worth like $55 or something. Uh, maybe $60 or something. No, I don't know. Um, I think the going price is actually 52 or $53. Uh, for a gram of gold So I'll just try it uh, try putting the Just uh, Just plain white they say white vinegar and so just cover them in there just enough, That's enough and uh, leave them for like 15 minutes Okay, so that's pretty shiny now it looks pretty much like gold um, I, I replaced the water once and I left them in probably a total of an hour, uh, not the water, the vinegar once. Um, and in between I, I switched it, I put, I put it, um, I, I, uh, took toothpaste and a toothbrush and brushed it with the toothpaste and that seemed to help quite a bit. Like the toothpaste turned all like dirty color like and and uh it got the started shining more then so i mix between vinegar and toothpaste toothbrush brushing it um got it pretty clean i'm gonna try selling it on ebay i think because i don't really want gold i want silver because gold's expensive right now and silver is undervalued i think and gold is Maybe not overvalued, but there is a really a lot of it in the world compared to, and it's not being used for anything. It's all just being kept in reserves. You know, they they mine gold and then they they just put it in reserves. See here on eBay, this is one gram of gold, and you have it at sixty-eight ninety-nine U.S. on eBay. That's like, I'd be buying it for 91 to 22 because I'm in Canada, but, um, yeah, the price I was thinking of before, $52 or $53, was actually the U.S., uh, what, I was thinking in U.S. dollars, 